Good morning, everybody. It is 5.13 in the morning. I just woke up. I'm super tired, but I'm super excited because we're going to Disneyland today, you guys. I'm taking you guys with me today. We are going to be vlogging this. It's going to be a two-park ticket, so I'm super happy, super excited about that. I'm going to get my face situated, and then I'll see you guys when I'm ready to talk to you guys again. So we're on our way. It is in the morning and we're pretty much rushing over there to see if we can make it on time because we have to be there by 7 o'clock so I want to show you my first meal of the day I'm having a protein shake I've got two scoops of Nutrilite plant-based protein powder in here it's a 20 grams of protein one cup of frozen fruit and half a twist to and ice and water that's it you guys so just wanted to show you my first meal of the day and then I'll kind of take you through what I'm eating today okay I'll see you in the next clip so, so far we've been in traffic for 30 minutes, literally just like at a standstill for 30 minutes. Barely getting onto the freeway again. And the second meal of the day, mango. Thank you. We'll see you on the bobsled ride. Welcome to the small it is so hot, so
everybody we just got done with boot camp I'm super excited for the footage that I got to film for you guys the ladies did super awesome they really pushed hard so I want to show you that clip right now I'm gonna go ahead and play it for you guys and I hope you enjoyed the rest of this footage I'm not sure what is gonna be coming after the HBR girls clip but it might be back in chest from what I did today for my um, strength training I did the boot camp style training with the girls for cardio so this is the perfect type of exercise to do you guys if you guys don't have that much equipment if you're looking to do something for weight loss to tone up your body these type of exercises are awesome for that full body full body movements full body training it's gonna get your heart rate elevated and your metabolism revved up so without further ado here are the HBR girls in action I hope you enjoy the rest of this footage morning everybody it is Thursday the 18th I'm here at the gym it is about 7 37 a little bit late I'm gonna go in there and get this plyo workout done I've got plyos today so that's very high intensity leg focused to kind of get some type of you know intense cardio in other than the lifting we're doing that once a week this is exactly what the ladies at HBR fit camp are going to be doing today so I'm gonna be filming them as well and showing you guys some footage from their workout so I'm super excited about that but pretty much I just kind of wanted to talk about what is the best time to work out some people think or some people believe that mornings are the best time to work out before you've had anything to eat so fasted workouts other people say it's best to work out like in the evening or something or like when the Sun is at its height highest peak or something like that and the truth is that there is no science to back up any true or greater benefit to working out in the mornings doing fasted workouts or fasted cardio which is what a lot of people tend to do when we're trying or striving for weight loss efforts or weight loss goals. But like I said, the truth is that there's no true evidence that supports that that is better than doing exercise with 
fuel in your stomach or with fuel in your body. So I say that the best time to work out is the time that works best for you. If you feel better working out on an empty stomach, maybe so that you're not digesting the food during your workout, then yes, work out on a fasted stomach. Preferably that would be in the morning so that you don't have to worry about letting hours pass by so that the food has digested in your stomach. But other than that, really, the best time to work out is when it works best for you and when you feel at your best. Really, there's no evidence that says this is the optimal time to work out. This is when you're going to reach your highest peak or you're going to get the most benefit. Really, it's all about training with intensity. Yes, most of the result is going to come from nutrition. They say it's 80% nutrition, 20% exercise, but that 20% should be super intense. You should be working out intensely, getting a good sweat going, getting your heart rate elevated, you know, depending on your goals. So the best time to work out really is just the time that works best for you. My hubby's here, so we're going to go ahead and head inside and get this done. Talk to you guys later.